Lusengu Obasanjo speaks tough again. Says Nigeria's policies won't yield any result if this continues. So guys, let's hear this emergency shocking statements as Obasanjo speaks. As we hear the details of the report, Former President Ulusegu Obasanjo has expressed concern over Nigeria's inability to implement policies effectively, describing the country as a barrier ground for policies. Speaking at the Ulusegu Obasanjo Space Center in Abuja, during the eighth engineer brigadier general retired Michael Agu, a new distinguished lecture and award, the former president lamented that despite having sound policies, Nigeria has failed to execute them resulting in stalled progress across various sectors of the country. Olusegu Obasanjo's comment reflects his frustration with the country's cyclical nature of advancement, where steps forward are often negated by backward movements. It is not enough for leaders to have policies or make statements. Ambassador remarked, we are not short of policies in Nigeria. Unfortunately, Nigeria has become a burial ground of policies that are either unimplemented or unexecuted. According to Ulusegu Obasanjo, Nigeria cannot make progress in this regard. And so Ulusegu Obasanjo says this is exactly what has been happening in Nigeria's national life and has long as this trend continues, the new progress will remain elusive. And so, Olusegu Obasanjo urged Nigeria's leaders to adopt a more focused approach to governance, warning against attempting to address every challenge simultaneously. According to him, let us carry the one we can carry. We cannot be jack of all trades and master of none, Obasanjo added. Recall the event organized by the Nigerian Institute of Space Engineers marked 21st year of Nigeria involvement in space exploration from 2003 to 2024. The theme of the lecture was Nigeria's 21st years in space, achievements, challenges, and prospect. And so, Olusegu Obasanjo, who was the special guest of honor was presented with an award as the Grand Commander of Nigerian Space Exploration in recognition of his contribution to Nigeria's space program. Reflecting on his administration effort in space exploration, Lusegu Obasanjo noted 
that over 100 Nigerians engineers were sent to China for training in various specializations. When the National Space Research and Development Agency was established under his government, his vision was for Nigeria to only launch satellite, but also build the capacity to produce them domestically. And so, Olusegun Obasanjo outlined an ambitious plan. The first satellite to be launched by China. The second in collaboration with China. And the third to be entirely done in Nigeria. Made. However, he expressed regret that this vision was not only realized, he pointed out that the National Space Research and Development Agency faced a serious challenge under subsequent administrations including a time when the agency was reportedly unable to pay its workers. The lecture served as a platform for Ulusegu Obasanjo, the former president of Nigeria, to reiterate his call for leaders to back up their policies with concrete actions. So guys, how do you see to the analysis of Ulusegu Obasanjo as he speaks tough again that Nigeria policies would yield any meaningful result if Nigerian leaders and their policies continue to go in this direction, that it will be very difficult for Nigeria to make progress. Can you share your thought on this? Drop your comment on the comment section below. And do not forget to like and subscribe to Blaze channel. Thank you.